And winners and losers in the world of weather. A warm Wednesday with sunshine and a few showers, but it turns colder and wetter for all of us. I'll have all the details of that and more live from Jersey. You. Yes, let's move on to another topic. We talked about the weather so much last week with the warmth and sunshine. It's all set to change. But I came to Jersey for the weekend and it was so beautiful. I wanted to stay to bring you the weather this morning. It's the southernmost of the Channel Islands, the largest as well. It's 12 miles away from the French coast, 100 miles from the coast of the UK. The sun will be shining this morning, but will it last? Here's the all important details. Well, no, is the word we're going to use for the weather this week. At the moment, we've got warmth still around. The jet stream is just the right side of us to keep the warmth and the sunshine. But as we head through the week, the jet stream slips its way southwards, allowing the floodgates to open for colder air to move in and also the return of some wetter weather. And by the end of the week, it will be cold enough for even some flakes of snow. Yes, so all change. But first thing this morning, it's largely dry for many of us with clear skies in the north. We have a touch of frost for parts of Scotland and Northern Ireland. Typically, temperatures further south starting between four and six degrees so a fresh start first thing scattered showers for northern areas of england they'll last for most of the day but for many of us it's largely dry so largely dry decent spells of sunshine taking us through the day temperature wise it's still above average across the board we're seeing highs of maybe 16 or 17 degrees the outlook is for clearer conditions overnight tonight some mist and fog to develop with again a frost for some northern areas watching out through southern areas for some showers developing and they last through the day tomorrow and then the outlook for the the rest of the week turns colder for all of us. The fort was built to protect the island of Jersey for Queen Elizabeth I back in the 1500s. Now here, the beautiful bay behind me, St. Oban's Bay, beautiful. It was packed yesterday with people in the gorgeous sunshine and weather this week is set to change pretty dramatically. It starts off warm. We have the sunshine, but as we head through the week, it turns colder, wetter and windier. But for today, here's how things are looking. Clear initially, a chilly start to the day with a touch of frost and some fog around. Largely dry to start, but a few showers through northern areas of England. Now as we head through the day today, showers move from northern England into southern Scotland. Showers on the light side, maybe the odd heavy one at times, but most of us looking dry. And with the sunshine today and the light winds, temperatures bouncing back above average into the mid to high teens. But make the very most of that because dramatic changes through the week. It turns cooler for all of us, wetter as well, increased chance of seeing showers and tumbling temperatures. 100 miles away from the coast of England, but just 12 from the coast of France. And it is absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous sunshine prevails here this morning as it does across most of the UK. Just a few showers around but the outlook this week turns much colder. First thing this morning a chilly start for northern areas, a touch of frost but typically four to six to start so a fresh start to the day compared to the cold conditions of last week. Mist and fog quickly lifts and clears and breaks and the showers for northern England migrate their way into southern areas of Scotland. Elsewhere largely dry with some decent spells of sunshine. Temperature still above average into the mid to high teens. Make the most of that because it turns much colder later this week.